Well, hello, there are Chicago Bears fans, and there's a lovely host there. That is right, it is the Rice or Yep, it's falling April, and that means the NFL fans, the NFL draft is upon us, coming up very soon, thank God. Anyway, I do have social media accounts, Chicago Bears fans, but don't worry, I'll discuss it later on in the video. Thank you very much for understanding. Now, I want you guys and gals to sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to drink, or maybe just maybe you want to chill out the villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Once again, there will be a link. There's an article, and you can check out the video down below. It is your choice. Okay, now, what the hell are the Bears going to do with these picks? They better. Make it smart. Recently, they got rid of Justin Fields. I think that was a stupid idea. I'm sorry for saying that, but I thought they're going to keep him and then draft another quarterback. And then the rookie could learn from Justin Fields and then he could figure out his own game plan. But once again, Bears mess up. We'll find out if this is going to be a total disaster or very successful. We're not going to know. The first year or at all, you know, give this rookie a chance, whoever that will be. Okay. It could be the guy from USC or it could be another quarterback. We'll find out. But I, I'm still bummed out. Bears only got a six round pick. It could be a fourth round pick if Justin Fields play a lot of snaps or whatever. But good luck for him. Now, back what I was going to say about this discussion. Now, probably a lot of you don't like the Bears GM. Hey, I don't like him either, but, you know, I don't care what he does. I mean, I do, but we don't have no control over it. Right, Bears fans? Yeah, let me just show you this. Right here, see? Information to read it, you know? I don't think any perfect GM, they always screw up, but... If this Ryan Post turn this team like a playoff contender and have a great run, all the Bears fans were very angry when he traded Justin Fields away. And if the Bears ever won the Super Bowl with this roster, I know it's not going to happen. Then the fans will be very happy. And then he probably will get a award because he turned this team for nothing to a contender. But probably it's not going to happen, you know? I'm just saying, you know? So we'll see. This might bite bears in the butts or not. You know, I have no issue with Justin Fields, but he did not throw it deeply. I know it's not his fault. We all know that. It's the coaching staff. Now, I guarantee it's going to be the same result with this another quarterback. They're not going to let him throw deep. It'd be screen passes. And then, of course, the fans like myself will complain. And they won't do any good if you complain, does it? No. We want to see a quarterback go throw it down the middle, double coverage with, without getting interception, without getting pick six. I know no quarterback will always get picked off, you know, and hopefully this guy, whoever it is, guy, move out of the pocket. No, just stand there and just throw it before the defense comes after him for a sack because Justin Fields, he did not throw it really that fast. I know he did in college. College and pro are different things. Now, how do we know if this guy is going to be a total bust or not total bust? I guess we got to find out a couple games into the season or what. Now, they say if this guy does very well in his rookie, he might break the rookie record for the Chicago Bears. That'd be lovely. You know? And hopefully he's not going to say, I'm going to throw for 400 yards. And who said it last year? Justin Fields. And that did not end well. You know what I'm saying? So we'll see what's going to happen. Please, Bears, let this guy air it out. If he gets picked off, he's got to learn from his mistakes. Rookies are never perfect. That's why they call them rookies. Does anyone know, is any one quarterback had a very amazing year and then they keep Adding, did Payne Manny had a good rookie year? I don't remember. I don't remember. So, sorry. 
So, and look at, he won two Super Bowls. It took a long time because he had a great coaching staff. It took a long time. Now, I don't know if I'm going to, I don't know if this guy is going to be a championship material or like in the past, a total bust. Have a good one. Don't give up on your bears. Follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. Now, if you want to be part of the Robert Show, that's fine. And if not, don't worry about it. See you guys once this edition. Peace out, and thank you very much for listening and watching.